Shots from Sea Ray, Boston Whaler, Grady White, and more. Marine Max provides world class service, financing, and insurance, educational programs, and access to getaway trips. See what all the excitement is about. Visit their new location on the Intercoastal at Beach Marine and at marinemax.com slash Jacksonville. Now, the 10-minute drill. This is a big one. Brought to you by tireoutlet.com. Wholesale prices, premium service. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Hit it. Oh, this is fun. I got some good sports concepts and rationalizations to throw your way, and hopefully you'll be able to answer my first question. I will. I'll dive right in. I I'll guarantee. Remind the listeners that at the end of this exciting segment, where we go back and forth, we yell fight. and scream, yeah. uh, we will get after it. And Who's beef, leading the poll uh, right out of the gates? Just wondering who. Uh, uh, butters. The Butters, yeah. Yeah. yeah oh. Butters is a jackass. Wow. I, would, I, I could probably... I can't lift my left arm, buddy. I can, I'm not going to be able to actually fight anyone. Maybe That's I can, pretty cool. Maybe I can verbally joust with Butters. Uh, the folks, what about Muschamp? Could have put him on there. I, I released my hatred of Muschamp. You did release yeah. it. Uh, Butters has 44%. Yeah. Uh, I have 27% yeah. just ahead of Joe U. Yeah, I still say you win. And Kyle Shanahan has just 6%. And uh, the irony is that really Kyle Shanahan uh, was the, the most. The wrath he was drew. The, but Kyle Shanahan was the most reckless with my. Mm-hmm. You could put a baseball Hall of Fame voter. That would be timely. You could put yes. him in there. Yes. So uh, at the end of this segment, and this is the uh, ten minute drill, uh, we will hand out a prize pack. Beef. What are we giving out today? My goodness, it's a glorious prize. pack. Okay, yeah. good. Uh, one is it ever Guggen- not glorious? No. At the end of uh, this segment, like you said, one lucky Guggen is going to get twenty bucks to spend at one thousand degrees pizza. Oh That's yeah, thousand is hot. Please <laughs> let it sit for a minute before you eat it. Cooks in two minutes, Danny. Hey, uh, I, hey, is it safe to say you've burnt the roof of your mouth? More times on pizza than any other food by a mile? Yes. Maybe soup would come yeah. in second. It's, but it's pizza, we don't eat soup a lot down here. It's pizza by a mile yeah. for me. I burnt the roof of my mouth with pizza. I'd say 20 to 1 over any other food. I would say that's fair. Hot pockets. Uh, oh, no, hot okay. pockets get yeah. you. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah, you'll get 20 bucks to 1,000 Degrees Pizza. They're celebrating their new Southside branch, and that's where the gift card is for, the new Southside location of 1,000 Degrees Pizza. Okay. You'll also get a gift card from Zips Express Car Wash. They've got seven area locations to serve you, including Beautiful. one in Orange Park. Now, uh, now, we got some votes for Urban Meyer and two votes for Dennis Quaid. Yeah. Uh, people have tweeted in. I think um, you hate Denny Quaid more than me. I would put him on your list. Is also a good one. Uh, you know, that one's too easy. Yeah, yeah. That's a, that would be a runaway. Who was? A, who did you say? But oh, Urban, I no. Must champ would kill Prosser. Is a, no one. doubt. Yeah, yeah. I yeah. agree. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's fair. and yeah. <laughs> All right. So uh, listen, if you didn't watch last night, then you can't answer. But I did, so I have some observations. Oh. But I'll ask you. Did you? By the way, ice cube in the soup, man. That's the beauty of soup. You oh, yeah. never have to burn your. That's mouth. true. Okay. Oftentimes, when I go to the a Japanese steakhouse, mm-hmm. I'll put the ice in the yeah. soup. Uh, did you, but I, I I love French onion, and that's a little tougher to put because that's it's covered fair. with Correct. piping hot cheese. Yeah. Did well, you I wa- hate French onion. Did you watch the Pro Bowl Challenge last night? And if you did, what are your observations? No, I didn't watch it. Not I, at all? Uh, no, not at all. I was okay. asleep by the time that came on, okay. Dan. I uh, get my beauty rest. All right. Well, it's not had worked yet, but years of trying there are two. Rest. There are a couple funny things uh-huh. that happened. In I the, saw the, uh, saw some of the highlight package. I saw uh, Von Miller couldn't throw, you know, throw it in the... Ocean from the pier. Yeah. Guess who else couldn't throw it in the pier? Andrew Luck huh. was awful. Adam Thielen hit more targets. Yeah, I heard that. Than Andrew Luck. How's and that it, possible? Is his shoulder hurting? No, no, he's just missing. It looked like it might have been a windy day uh, down there, but the boys, the boys were struggling. Russell Wilson uh, uh, won, but I, I did enjoy. The uh, uh, in one of the obstacle races, they had to push the sled. Yeah, I've seen these these before. And, yeah, and Kyle Williams was pushing for the AFC, uh, and I forget who was for the NFC. But Kyle Williams, the first ten yards, jumped out. But then the the great gigantic animal in the sky fell onto his back, <laughs> and Big Kyle was dying, and the other guy caught him and and passed him. But Kyle toughed it out and finished, and the AFC ended up winning that competition. And then, of course, the exciting dodgeball finish uh, came down to it, and. Uh, the NFC. I mean, Kyle won the Williams of uh, uh, Buffalo made the Pro Bowl. Yeah, it was kind of a, kind of a. Because he's this retiring, is, right? Yeah, kind of a salute to Kyle. I think. Is that what it was? I believe so. Has he been a Pro Bowler before? Yes, he has. Okay. Yeah, that's. I I almost I did, I did a double take because I'm uh, yes. I'm surprised he's a Pro Bowler this year. Good for him. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. All right, uh, Dan. I'm going to give you the option or obligation. You can choose whichever term you do because of what we do. I would uh, prefer that we. 
I use the terminology option because right. I would hate for what we love to ever be an obligation. But if you were either forced or could only use whatever mindset you need to answer the question. All right, let me get into a mind bend here. All right, so would you would you prefer or gun to your head would choose to mm-hmm. watch the Pro Bowl or the Senior Bowl? Ah, uh, Pro Bowl. Oh, really? Not even close. Yeah. No hesitancy. Yeah. I like it, the senior bowl practices. I don't like the game. Here's the thing, though. There's an absolute the, – the players don't get that the week is more important than the no, game. No, I know. So they're play, I mean, you want to talk about the polar opposite mm-hmm. of intensity. Yeah. You got guys that are playing for the most yeah. attention that they can, and then the other guys you yeah, got no, guys – No, I'd much rather watch – I'd much rather watch the Pro Bowl. I'll tell you what. And, I, I, and I'm a road scout, but I, I, I watch uh, the practices. I love the you, practices. And you – I mean, I use the word because – well, because it is so – Harsh, you hate the Pro Bowl. Yeah. Like, you won't watch the Pro Bowl. No. Yeah. Is it afternoon or is it night? That's a good question. I think it's Sunday <laughs> night, isn't it? Did they do it afternoon one year? It's usually night. I don't know. Pro Bowl? Yeah. I don't know. I, I, I don't. I'm going to say the Pro Bowl is uh, Sunday night, but I'll double check that for you, Fred. Yeah. No, senor. Yes. No, senor. Yes. So, uh, speaking of the Senior Bowl, uh-huh. uh huh. Riser Fall. Three o'clock. As, just as I said. Three Boom. O'clock. You should take the boy King right down there. He would enjoy it. Yeah, I know. He asked me. He's asked me. Yeah. He would love to go. It's not happening. Uh, risers and fallers at the Senior Bowl at the quarterback position, by all accounts, uh, Dilfer got it right. Drew Locke up the board. Daniel Jones, not so much. Well, Your thoughts? Well, my thoughts are, I, can we just stop the process right now? Because if for the first time in like seven years, I've gotten one right out of the gates. I didn't like Daniel Jones, and I I prefer Drew Locke. Okay. So I'm not shocked, but again, that's based on my pedestrian, amateur quarterbacking eye that would have a saddle with Johnny Manziel if you let me lose. Um, so, no, I'm not surprised. I'm not surprised. I don't trust a guy from Duke, just as I didn't trust, you know, uh, Josh Allen last year from Wyoming, you know. And, and, and Drew Locke, to me, just reading and watching – and I like the fact that in you know it took him a little time to to get up to pace this year, but that's because for the first time he was in a pro set and having to make pre snap reads and adjustments and audibles. So, yeah, and and it's it's buoyed even more by what Trent Dilfer told us yesterday. So, no, it's not completely shocking to me that you think that you know in Drew Lock. I mean, scouts think Drew Lock would be next in line over there also. So, no, that that's not a a huge surprise. It did surprise me that. That Dilfer, he came short of putting him in Dwayne Haskins' territory, but yes. he did include him, you know, closer to him than than to that crowd that he's with over there um, in Mobile. There's a lot of uh, there's a lot of good position players. I mean, the Debo Samuel, the kid from Ohio State, McLaurin has really shined this week. There's tight ends all over coming out this year. The Jags have to hit some home runs in the tight end and receiver categories uh, in the draft. They must. Oh yeah, there's um, yeah. There's, yeah, there's no way around that. That's uh, absolutely true. So, uh, what about Drew Locke? Did you hear the Drew Locke? And this is so funny because I can relate, uh, um, and I'll make an admittance right now. But Drew Locke had some sort of flag uh, on his high school records, and they asked him what it was, and he goes, "I cheated on a geometry test in ninth grade." <laughs> okay. Because I remember this is during the, when he was being interviewed by the media. He goes, "Yeah, I cheated on a geometry test in ninth grade." He goes, I know I shouldn't have done it, but I remember I had a big basketball game that night, and I didn't have time to study for the test. And <laughs> yeah, I mean, nice. welcome to the welcome to the real world. Yeah, Drew, Drew I mean, you you and eighty four percent of the other high school. Not athletes. that we're encouraging that, children. No, of course not. Don't you do that? Yeah, I don't. Um, Cheaters never prosper. Calculus, I would cheat. Geometry, I would just make my way through. But hey, that's just me. That's just you. Uh, you know, sometimes you fiddle your way out of good scenarios. Like, remember when the Pro Bowl, they bounced around with Team Dion versus Team uh, Irvin. Okay. And now the All-Star game has blown what could have been a really good thing. What did they do? Well. The captains? The picks? Yeah, the captains. Second year in a row, it'll be this time it's Team LeBron against Team Giannis. Okay. Uh, They're the two leading vote getters. But the starters were named in each league, so they'll start by. But I don't want them to reshuffle the starters. Did you see what would be the starting lineup for the Western Conference? Yeah, West and East look good. Yeah, how how would you like to how would you like to stop this team? LeBron James, yeah, James Harden, mm-hmm. Steph Curry, yeah, Kevin Durant, yeah. and Paul George. I'll tell you this, there'll be a lot of chemistry issues on that team. <laughs> yeah. Any one of those, other than maybe Steph. 
Yeah. Maybe Steph and George could play together. I well. think that East five could Which play with them. Which was what? Giannis. Uh huh. Who, who was the rest of them? I did. It looked. It looked. Um, uh, Kemba Walker's having a sensational yeah, year. Yeah, but still, you're going to put him with uh, Steph. Uh, uh, Joel Embiid, mm-hmm. uh, Giannis Antetokounmpo, um, something like that. Yeah, his brother Costas Antetokounmpo for the Dallas the team. for the Dallas Mavericks. Um, no, I don't know. I don't. Uh, uh, Kyrie. No. Kyrie is one. Yeah, that's a very good team. Can, man. Yeah, no, it's not as good as the other one. It'd be fun to watch. I like East versus West. I would rather be East versus West too. That's my point. Be- I don't. I don't. I don't like the, the better part is who's the last guy drafted. Again. I think this year they're gonna they're gonna televise the draft at least. They are, yeah, because last year they so did. we'll know who the last guy so, is. Yeah, and 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 you can just see his feelings will get but, hurt. But that'll be they'll be take some, your ball and go home, Kemba. There'll be some fun <laughs> interaction. I'm sorry, that's not gonna happen. You're out. But yeah, I would like to see it uh, broken down that way. All right. Well, it's not going to happen. All right. What did you make of this? The uh, the final uh, bit yeah. of the ten minute drill. You want to ask me about John Rahm, my pick at the uh, uh, and how he performed yesterday? Now, can you remind uh, the audience where you picked in the in the draft order? It wasn't first. I think it was first. No, absolutely not. Yeah, I believe it's it like was. third. Rhyme mm-hmm. Dog was first. Not uh, sure. Was I first? I think you. Yeah. I think you picked first, and you picked Rom. So I don't know how you <laughs> outwitted any of us who didn't have the opportunity. I picked Rom in our fantasy league. How are you doing in that? I got Dan in our fantasy golf league this year. I'm ahead of you. I don't think so. <laughs> yeah, I think I'm in first place. You're not in first place. How do you figure? I looked at it yesterday. You were like in sixth place. You don't even know what my team name is. So how You're can twins. you? Twins? No, I'm not twins. That's not me. How can you not be twins? Because there's another guy. Drew Doggers. You know who's twins? This will. You'll like this. Oh. Spanky's uh, monkeys. One of the uh, friends that uh, one of uh, Tony Baselli's friends that you I know, wish somebody would have told me that. Yeah, no, that's me right there at the top, friend. No hey. ace for you. Does that also make sense? Is that you? That's me, buddy. Son of a beast. Yeah, thing. see, they're twins. Is actually Baselli's former friend Alex, who's now better friends with me. Okay, that's twins. You know Alex, right? Uh, kind of. Yeah, we're really. bogging you down. Well, that's also a running bit if you're new to the show. As we've what we've, place am I in? We've stolen all of Tony Baselli's friends through the years because he's mean to him. What place uh, am I? You're in fourth place. All right, fine. You have 1.7 million. I'm in first place with 2.1 million. I have both Rom and Rose. Oh, you went hard on those two. Yes, I did. I also have Tiger, which. Uh, What's your last question? Tiger I, shot a 270 today, Dick, uh, yesterday. It looked okay. Yeah, that's pretty much That's a great summation. That's a great analysis. That's I, I, a great I, I, question. What's funny to me is I um, snuck out on the golf course myself yesterday afternoon. I was done. We were inside and we were watching the golf, and a guy walks through and he stops. He goes, Oh, uh, today the opener of the golf season. I said, no, it just feels that way, right? Because just you know, Tiger's playing. Oh, I guess you're right. Tiger's playing. Yeah, we've had three weeks, friend. So all right. Uh, anyway, all right. Uh, that's the uh, ten minute drill. Let's do it. Time you'll never get back in your life. Hope you no. enjoyed it. But the good news is, if you stood through it and suffered, <laughs> you can now be caller number five and win the prize pack. We've tell them what they're going to win. Uh, once again, caller number five at six four one ten ten. Dan Jeff is going to get themselves a twenty dollar gift card. To 1,000 Degrees Pizza. They're celebrating their brand new Southside location, and you'll get 20 bucks to spend on some delicious pizza there. Also, a gift card from Zips Express Car Wash. They've got seven area locations to serve you, including one in Orange Park. Call number five right now, 641 1010. The drill from the studios at Republic Services. We'll handle it from here. Every day we deliver more Jacksonville.